Are they really worth all the effort and complexity, or are they just a fancy, expensive way to make your engine sound cool? Ugh. The age-old question function versus form. It's something everyone considering ITBs has to think about. Right, on the one hand, we've seen how ITBs can give you real performance benefits, especially for naturally aspirated engines. You know, improved throttle response, mm -hmm. the potential for more power and greater control over how you tune the intake system. So for those who really want to squeeze every bit of performance out of their engine, those gains can be significant. Absolutely, but there's no denying that setting up ITBs the right way is more complicated. It requires a deeper understanding of how everything works, a lot of attention to detail, and a willingness to experiment and fine tune. It's not just a simple bolt-on mod. There's a certain level of commitment involved that might not be for everyone. You got it. If someone's looking for a quick and easy way to gain horsepower, ITBs might not be the best choice, but for those who really love building engines, who enjoy the challenge of optimizing every little thing, and who want that raw connection between the driver and the machine, ITBs can be incredibly rewarding.